I don't have to tell you things are bad. Everybody knows things are bad. It's a depression. Everybody's out of work or scared or losing their job. The dollar buys a nickel's worth. Banks are going bust. Shopkeepers keeping a gun under the counter. Punks running wild in the street and there is nobody anywhere who seems to know what to do. And there's no end to it. We all know that the air is unfit to breathe and our food's unfit to eat. And we sit watching our TVs while some local newscaster tells us that today we've had 15 homicides and 63 violent crimes as if that's the way it's supposed to be. Well, we all know things are bad, worse than bad. They're crazy. It's like everything everywhere is going crazy, so we don't go out anymore. We sit in the house and slowly the world around us is getting smaller. And all we say is, please, at least leave us alone in our homes. Let me have my toaster and my TV and my steel belly radials and I won't say anything. Just leave us alone. Well, I'm not going to leave you alone. I want you to get mad. I don't want you to protest. I don't want you to riot. I don't want you to write your congressman because quite frankly, I wouldn't know what to tell you to write him. I don't know what to do about the depression or the inflation and the Russians and the crime in the street. All I know is that first, you've got to get mad. You've got to say, I am a human being, goddammit. My life has value. I want you to get up now. I want you to get up out of your chairs. I want you to get up right now and go to the window. Open it and stick your head out and yell, I am as mad as hell and I'm not going to take this anymore. I want you to go to the window right now. Sit up. Go to your windows, open them and stick your head out and yell, I am as mad as hell and I'm not going to take this anymore. Things have got to change. But first, you've got to get mad. You've got to say, I am as mad as hell and I'm not going to take this anymore. Then we'll worry about the depression and the inflation and the oil crisis. But first, I want you to get mad. I want you to get up out of your chair, go to the window, stick your head out and yell and say it. I am as mad as hell and I'm not going to take this anymore.